G'day all, welcome back to Dad vs. Son, our playthrough of Combat Volume 2 from Ross Motel and Compass Games. And we're about to uh, go on with our uh, Dad's Dodgy Dozen campaign, and we are currently about to start uh, Mission 62, which is a night attack, excuse me, night attack mission in the village map. Um, we start with eight people, I've got them into two main groups into four teams so since uh, myself and erica are foxhole buddies i've got us together here and then uh, i've got mortel and christopher here so ross and christopher here that gives us an automatic weapon here and an automatic weapon here um, i've got evade on all these people down the bottom uh, under the basic control of uh, Greg is uh, is Jester, who's going to stick with Greg, and I've got uh, Ricardo and Cliff down here. Uh, so they're all sprinting. We're all bold because we're fanatical. The Germans are all bold, and I've rolled up for them and set them out as per the instructions. Uh, so they've got evade, sprints, runs, and guns on them. Um, the Max line of sight for this I've rolled up is a four, uh, two plus two. Uh, so yeah, line of sight is only four, which is um, going to be interesting. Um, the Germans have uh, a chance at, oh, I've lost one, don't know where it went, have a chance of reserves on turns three, five, and seven on a roll of five to nine and that will give them effectively uh, five troops each which come over in I think 34.6 through 34.10 um, each time. So they start with 22 troops against our eight, so we're outnumbered uh, two and a half to one sort of thing, two and three quarters to one to start with. Um, as you can see, everybody's bold, so they start on 22, so half is 11 down to 10 because of being bold, half of 10 is 5, down to 4 for surrender. We're 8, down to 4, which makes 3, and then 1 for surrender. Uh, so they could end up with a maximum of 37 troops. So uh, we could be outnumbered anything up to 5 to 1. Um, and that is why I am going to deploy... Uh, in the rear areas. Now, with victory points for this, oh, in fact, first up, uh, this uh, uses uh, campaign game scenario three for this, and it has its own, uh, its own um, event tables in it, which I'll be using. The victory points for this are the usual, but in addition, if the Germans get um, at the end of the game, each unwounded enemy in columns 12 to 15 will be minus 1. Anybody between 8 and 11 will be minus 2. 5 to 7, minus 3. And anyone in the first four columns will be minus 4 VP for us. Um, and we get uh, 1 VP for each unwounded or bandaged friendly character in columns 30 to 33 yeah all the way over here at the end of the game as well so uh, yeah it's going to be interesting uh, one is to the north uh, the wind is blowing from the northwest to the southeast it is clear the ground is firm so that is that so um, I've got a hand size of two to start with and these are the two cards I've drawn. Uh, and they're just absolutely scrumptious, aren't they? Uh, so I've got a Can't Think Straight with a 68 90, 92. 
and I've got this one here with an 88896. Um, so I'm going to use this one to start with because we don't really care. So um, we can bring this over ready to go and we'll get, draw up some German initiative cards. So they'll have a 7, 41, 49, 37. So it's going to be yellow, blue, white, red. Um, and then it is going to be Charlie Abel Baker. And the, may the Lord have mercy on our souls. Okay. Right. Yellow, blue. Let's get into it. Yellow, sprint 5, 6. So he's not going to be going far. Uh, whoop, stay there, cheeky. Run and gun 6 comes up here. In fact, I might just move all these guys, so hang on a tick. It's not really going to matter. Uh, sprint 5. Sprint 6. Run and gun 6. Uh, run and gun 6 and evade 5. Okay. Just to be difficult. Oh, come off it. Oh, Jesus Christy mighty poos. You didn't do it again, did you? Uh, evade 5. Sprint 6. Sprint 6. Evade 5. Run and gun 6. Run and gun 6. Sprint six, sprint six, sprint five, and run and gun five. Evading six, sprinting six, so ducks back. Evading five, evading six, evading six, evading six and evading five. Okay, so that's all of them gone to start with. We'll move us, um, and we are evading to here, and we are evading to here, and these two are sprinting to here, and these two are sprinting to here. And that is the end of impulse one. We go over to impulse two, and the same thing again. Sprinting six, one, two. Sprinting six is one, two, and a duck back. Sprinting five. Run and gun six. Sprinting six, so he'll go into there and duck back. Run and gun six. Sprinting five. Evading six. Run and gun five. Sprinting six. Sprinting five. Is okay. Sprinting five is into a building. Yep. Uh, ducks back. Run and gun six. Run and gun six. Okay. Don't go there then. Uh, evading six. Evading six this time. Evading five this time. Evading six, 
Evading six. Evading five. Hiding. And evading five. That's all the Germans done. We'll come over to our guys. These two will sprint one, two, and these two will sprint one, two. These guys will evade one to here, and we will evade into here. And we can go on with impulse three. With Herman the German all ready to go. Sprinting six and ducks back. Duck back. Uh, sprinting six. So he goes to there and can't sprint through there, I don't believe. Um, oops, wrong one. Didn't think you could sprint through um, there. No, it's not rough. There's a one for a stream rather than just a depression. And there's not. Which is a bit strange. She's sprinting through there. Okay, well, you're going to sprint through there. Um... there. Uh, run and gun 5 to there. Evading 6. Evading 5. Hiding. Sprinting 6. Is 1, 2. Oh, no. Come on back. There you go. Ducking back stays there. Evading five. Uh, sprinting five. Goes to there. Running gun six. Hiding man. Uh, sprinting. Five, one, two, ducking back stays there, running gun six, comes out here, running gun five, comes into there, evade six, uh, evade five, fine, stay there. Running gun six, evading five, evading six, and evading six. And that's all of them. We come over to our mob, we evade forward, and we evade forward to there. So these guys will now duck back. Um, they're covering off this area and this area here. All of this, basically. And I want to get Erica and me up into these rocks. Um, and then we will cover off this flank here. Like that. These two here are going to go... Um, sprint sprint and he will duck back not both of them <coughs> and he'll go in there with him and these two here will go one one two to here I want to get them up sort of here so they can cover off this area and in here uh, for anybody coming across there sort of thing. Uh, I'd, I'd love to get them up here, but it's so easy for them to sneak up. I want to have some sort of line of sight. In fact, I might put them there. So if they were back there, he can go one, two to there, and that gives them a clear line of sight out this way. And he can come 
over 1, 2 to there like that. And then we can go on to impulse 4. Okay, Germans first. Sprinting 5, 1, 2. Sprinting six, uh, 5, 1, 2. Sprinting 6, 1, 2. Sprinting 5, 1, 2. Run and gun 5, down to here. Dating 5. Dating 6. Evading 6. Hiding. Um, run and gun 6. Run and gun 6. Hiding. And hiding. Run and gun 6 into there. Evading 6 into there. Run and gun 6. Hiding. Evade 6. Evade 5. Evade 6. And evade 6. And hiding. So that is the end of turn 1. As you can see, they've really come forward in the front here. Some support forces. A little recce out here. Uh, and the bulk are up here. Um, so I don't want to really get in the way of that. So we can reset this. Turn that stuff. Put that up to turn 2. We can discard the German cards. Uh, we can get rid of moves. We can get rid of orders. Um, so that is it. We've been going for 17 minutes. I think that'll do. That'll do, pig. That'll do. Uh, it'll start to slow down a little bit from now on. So we'll call that uh, turn one and go from there. Um, I've got the five re-rolls, um, so we're just waiting on them to come on up. So I want to get Jester in here. Because they've got so many coming forward in one hit, I want at least two people in each hex um, in case they get swarmed, and that's the thing. So uh, I'll bring Ross down into here uh, with a run and gun or whatever else, and... Uh, Erica and I can move up to the rocks or down to this tree. It's much of a muchness, uh, but they've got more chance of getting past us unless we're up here. So uh, it, this is just too easy to get charged into, and the same sort of there. Um, so uh, I don't want to really do that. Okay, so I'll call it quits there. Take care, and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.